The news media is influential because they reach a lot of people. Digital influence is also measured by reach. The number of people who have opted into your community is a measure of influence. But since engagement is just a fraction of that number, those with less than a thousand followers have almost no influence. This is the null level. Those with one to 10,000 followers, and there are a number of successful B2Bs at this level, are nano influencers. Micro level is 10 to 50,000 followers, and some of the highest engagement rates are here. Mid-tier level is an audience of 50 to 500,000 followers. An example would be Brian Solis, the digital analyst. Next level up is macro with 500,000 to a million followers. And Handley, who runs Marketing Profs, is a macro influencer. Top of the ladder is Mega, and these are celebrities with 1 to 5 million followers, like Gary Vaynerchuk. If you're a nano doing 500,000 a year, how much more could you earn if you rose to micro? Could you double it? And if you're a micro and you level up to mid-tier, how much more could that earn you? If your influence level went from mid-tier to macro, how much revenue does that equal? And if you went from macro to mega, which not everyone can do, but let's say you reach Richard Branson level, what would that do to your empire? That's what I do. I take clients from nano to micro, micro to mid-tier, and in the next video, I'll show you how.